Representative Risky of Oregon, state chair. I talked to you about him the other day. Yes. Representative yes. Risky was on my program, Save the Nation, that comes on Andrew Womack's Gospel Truth TV, okay? He was on my program. I asked him a simple question. I said, why do you think it is important for Christians to be involved in public service? That's a paraphrase, almost maybe verbatim what I asked him. And he articulated what you and I believe and why we think it's important. We've seen the decline. We've seen the social de the, the decline, the moral decline in the country. And he's just articulating a winsome, I believe Christians should be involved because we know the truth. We uphold truth. And he made a statement and, and said, look, you know, look, Ilhan Omar and Rashid Tlaib, they make you think they don't love the country, Bishop. I yep. mean, they, they support Hamas terrorists that kill Jewish babies and women, let alone mm -hmm. the men that they killed October the 7th. They, they, they even say they want to take out American citizens. So that's okay for the left to have those people saying those kinds of things, right. okay? But yet... I think that it's perfectly okay for you to point out and say, wait a minute, Ilhan Omar was, was bragging on Somalia that that's her home. Yep. She's yep. serving in Congress. I got a problem with somebody that's wanting to do more for Somalia and a Muslim country or Hamas than they do their own people. But Representative Reshke made a simple statement. And do you know, they turned that into a national story. They right wing mm -hmm. watch who's watching you right now, probably. They're probably gonna get mm -hmm. both of us on this. Oh, both of it. us, sure. Yeah. And so Bishop, they clipped it out. But it's the it's the same standard operating procedure. Clip out a piece, twist it, and try to make people hate them. Freedom from Religion Foundation has gone after Representative Reshke. And here's what I found out yesterday, Bishop. Representative Reshke now has a formal complaint in the Oregon House of Representatives coming against him in the, in the Oregon Legislative Equity Office. You know, that's loaded, Bishop. They're coming after him formally as, as if he has charges against him because of comments under free speech and freedom of religion that yeah. he made on my program.